All right, let's move on to the opening movie instead of movies.、Uh, we only have one, The Huntsman: Winter's War, which is actually a prequel to Snow White and the Huntsman. And this one stars Chris Hemsworth as the Huntsman. Joining him is Emily Blunt, Jessica Chastain, and Charlize Theron return to play her,、uh, you know, the evil queen. And of course, this is all. Probably precipitated by、um, what went on behind the scenes between、uh, the director and the star of the、uh, previous film. Yeah, Christian Stewart and、um, Rupert Sanders. Basically, the tabloids caught,、uh, you know, has photographed evidence of Christian Stewart and Rupert Sanders getting cozy with each other. Yeah, cheating on their respective significant others. Yeah, Sander was a married man, and、um, Stewart was dating her co-star Robert in yeah, yeah Robert Pattinson, her co-star in the Twilight series. And、um, you know, at that time, they punished Stewart instead of Sander. So, and she she was written out of the movie pretty much.、Uh, they were planning on a Snow White and the Huntsman sequel, but given the scandal, I guess、uh, they chose to. Do a prequel that's focused on Chris Hemsworth, and hence this movie.、Uh, even the director is not here. No, no, he moved on to something else. I mean,、uh, you know, at that time I read that they were trying to keep him on, but given the heat, he chose to direct something else. The first movie grossed domestically 155 million, 396 million worldwide. I mean, obviously they wanted to make a sequel. This is just a, a brand that can they can build upon. And the trailer looks like it's more of the same. I think even better. I think the first movie wasn't that exciting. It's a take on Snow White and the、uh, you know Seven Dwarfs t- Tale, right? They add an action element、yeah. to it, and this one is、right. even more action packed, you know, than that. And you know, Emily Blunt is good in the、uh, action genre too, and so is Jessica Chastain. But the only thing is, this feels like I mean, sure, it's a prequel, but without Kristen Stewart, it feels like leftovers. From the first film,、uh, it is. But hey, you know, if you can replace Kristen Stewart with Emily Blunt and Jessica Chastain and a returning Charlize Theron, I think you're pretty good there.、Uh, you know, and they they ratchet up the、uh, the action element. Chris Hemsworth, outside of his Thor movies, <laughs>、uh, hasn't been very good.、Uh, ex- exactly. So that's the unknown here. <laughs> Kristen Stewart, because of the Twilight films, at least has her,、um, you know, loyal fan base. But I, I'm sure after what has happened, her loyal fan base will probably not as loyal. Well, here's the thing, though. I mean, her movies outside of the Twilight series, and besides、um, Snow White, there's a lot of qualifiers there. You know, you know, or, or kind of low key. Yeah, it seems like she chose the I'll do one big movie and one small movie. Right, right. But what I'm saying is not a given that she has an audience or fans outside of the Twilight movies. That's what I'm saying. Right, right. Yeah, because you know the sampling is very small.、Mm-hmm. So what what do you have this as? I'm not very optimistic. Okay, let's see. The first movie opened to fifty six million, right? Um, and. That is with the you know the Twilight the Halo effect from the Twilight movies that、uh, you know with Christian、yeah. Stewart. I you know e- even that I think it's、uh, and then you have the Jungle Book. I think the the second week for、yeah. the Jungle Books is going to perform well. I mean I I don't yeah because it, because it's so so well、off. reviewed. Yeah yeah I don't see a huge、yeah. drop off. I think maybe forty. I'm going below that. I think this just looks like eating leftovers. Okay、um, okay. I'm gonna go with the Chris Hemsworth non Thor. <laughs> I'm I'm thinking fifteen. Fifth, okay, fifteen. All right, I'm I'm shocked. Fifteen to twenty. I'll give you a range. Fifteen to twenty. Okay, I'm shocked. I'm shocked. But uh, who okay, knows? Fifteen to twenty. But I'm I'm gonna stick closer to fifteen. Okay, I I'm, I'm betting on Emily Blunt, Jessica Chastain, and Charlize Theron to lift the Chris Hemsworth curse. All right. To be able to break out, and this is his non-Thor movie that's gonna be able to do well because hey, you know you we'll have. We'll see if three. We'll see if three、um, good-looking, high. Quality actresses can bring Chris Hemsworth out of his curse. Yes, yes, yes. If they can't do it, then hey, there's no hope for him. There's no hope outside <laughs> Thor. I mean, yeah, the, yeah, outside Thor, he might have to go with the indie route. <laughs> I think he's okay as Thor. I mean, you know, but just, yeah, he's good as Thor. It's just、uh, don't give him anything outside of that. <laughs> so we'll see.